Yes! Oh, wow. It's a proper showdown. Yeah, what you? <laughs> Didn't think we're going to be this close. Mm -hmm. So you're going like two and a half kilo over the world record. How much? 171. 172 right there. Okay. That's an average man. <laughs> and the size of my balls. <laughs> Damn, bro. Oh, oh Jesus. Yeah. That's so easy. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Okay. He's ready? Oh. ready? Go. PR lifestyle is more than just hitting a PR on the squat bench or deadlifts. A PR could be going a week without skipping a meal. It's about being the best version of yourself, always improving. Here we are at the training hall with old Nugan, okay? And he is 73 years old. How many decades of grip training and competitive experience? Oh, uh, well, 60 years though. So 60. 60? Yeah, I started training when I was about 10 years old, so. Oh, you so, got me beat there too. I started at 14. Yeah. 10. Yeah. So. But of course, I never focused on grip training till uh, after I retired from Strongman. But okay. um, but I always use my hands, of course. And I even when I, I remember as a kid, I was bending iron and stuff like that. So long so, before I ever saw a gym. <laughs> <laughs> you just had it in you then. That's interesting. Yeah, so before you like, yeah. started lifting weights, you were bending iron. Uh, at the same time, kind of like at the same time. Yeah. So reading all the magazine about all the old time strongmen. So I was buying little pieces of uh, iron and bending them. And you know we. And there's technique, but it's uh, you know you work on it, you can get pretty good at it. We met uh, five years ago or so, and we had a competition. Well, your yeah, competition. Yeah. Martins was there. Yeah. I think I went. I did somewhere on this exact same movement around 100 kg, maybe 110. Yeah. You did 115. 115. Yeah. And Martins did 120. 125. 125. And by now mistake, you're by mistake. By <laughs> mistake. They missed loaded the bar, but Martins, being a god Martins, amongst men, yeah. still did it anyways. <laughs> and. Now, here you are five years later, 73, you're stronger than that with your hands. Yeah. You are doing about 125 now? Yeah, that should be good for at least 125. I think. And you have uh, no arthritis, nothing? Yeah, aches and pains, but uh, you know, keep, 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 keep them in shape, keep moving. All right. Keep I mean, doing. that inspires me because I always fear, okay, when's going to be that point in my career when, okay, no longer do I feel like a superhuman, I may have to pivot. So the fact that I know two things, I love arm wrestling yeah. and I love grip training. Yeah. I can do that oh, well into my 70s. It. And you can do and you can do the grip training. I, I'm doing the grip training as a, as a whole workout, basically. I use uh, grip stuff, uh, equipment for a lot of the events. Then do like light bodybuilding uh, as part of it. So you can really keep in good shape, I think. Because one of the things that when you're doing a deadlift with grip, with, 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 with axle, things like this, you can't lift as much. So you'll save your back and you save yourself a lot. That's a good perspective on it, actually. So, so with that said, I'll do my first rep. We're going to be doing a variety of grip challenges today and see if I can hang out with Oh, We're just going to have a little insight to see if, you know what? I haven't been doing any grip-specific training or movements, but I have been arm wrestling. So will there be any correlation from arm wrestling over to grip training. Let's find out. Ooh. No. <laughs> uh, I'm not so sure I did one something. Uh, five yeah, years you ago. did. <laughs> Believe me, it's healthy for me too. Um, okay. Foot chalk. I find the key for, for me is to have chalk here. If I don't have chalk here, I can't do anything hardly. Okay. In, the, in here. 
because you, you're so dependent on this. I'm going to go get some more chocolate. Sure. But I do the Saxon bar, I kind of do it like a semi uh, sumo. Okay. But, all, but all of there, I mean, like, but, like when I do uh, Axel or stuff like that, I do conventional. So I get, I get, so I get variation of lips. So this, uh, the process is a Saxon bar is just thick. You don't get very close to your body, but you're trying to get as close as possible. So I usually get it. I, I'm hitting my chin before I even start lifting and pushing it in the chin. And then I pull it up. Interesting, okay. That's very different now. It, it already feels a lot easier the second time. Against the shin. Too much, I think. Was that too much, right? Yeah, yeah. About slightly? Yeah, straight, yeah, just straight wrist, basically. Oh yeah, there it is. There's a sweet spot. <laughs> That's the heaviest hundred pound I've ever lifted. Five bar. Five bar. 150, 154. I shouldn't struggle with anything with the one in front of it. <laughs> but I, I did. There was a struggle with there. Yeah. It's not comfortable. I feel it like in my bone. Yeah, yeah. that's why I, have, I do like three or four of these just with the, this weight before I start going up. Okay. So. I feel it in my wrist significantly as well. Yeah. And I think, I think one of the things I found, and this is the same in almost all of the, all of the lifts, like even the inches of dumbbell and everything else, I, I try to hold this straight like this. Don't try to do this because that will do this and it will uh, be part of you. And the same thing on here, I hold my, my wrist will be totally straight but my fingers are underneath the bar. So I'm pressing up with, the, with my fingers, but I don't pressing up with the wrist, I'm pressing up with the fingers. Stabilize the wrist. Okay. Less, less things that will move. When you start, you know, when you start moving, the less joints are mo moving, the easier it is to hold on to it. I think when you, when uh, people tend to do, particularly the time to lift the hinge jump, but they go and do like this, well, there are no chance, because as soon as it get, gets up a little, they start moving here, and then they'll start moving, rolling. Because all this thing rolls out of your hands. Okay. Makes but sense. here. So I, I'm entirely, Basically, my whole front is totally straight. Get my hands on it as much as possible. Push it into my head legs. Try to hold that position. When I get to the top, I can't hold the position. But the fact that I'm holding the position as long as possible helps me. Does it help? It's getting warmed up. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Good, good. Easier each time. More blood in the area now. Yeah, for sure. It's the nervous system and, and blood in the area. Oh yeah. This kid's weight. <laughs> I was gonna say, can the average Joe do this weight? No. No. Okay. Uh, average person has worked out a little bit, can do 60 kilos probably. As a one rep max? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> All right. If they train on it though, they get, they get it up to 70, 80 kilos. Can you lock up better? Stand up. Yeah, yeah like that. Okay. Then we'll give it, we'll give it to you if you can. You can't be here, huh? That's to be. Shoulders back, got it. Before you go. Sorry, uh, sorry to interrupt. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> How many of your members that come here are capable of doing 90 kilograms, which you're about to do right now? Hmm. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> no, well, what do you think? Five? Maybe? Five, five, five six? Five, okay. Not many. Not many. The, the stronger guys, yeah. yeah. Like the bigger guys. Yeah. You, you want to try it? I'll, I'll take it, though, yeah. All right. All right. All right. No, well, yes, you're warmed up. You did good. <laughs> This leaves most people behind. Sir? Oh. Yeah, this leaves most people behind. Mighty people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Solid, right? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't see much struggle there. <laughs> Is the record for this held between you and Martins at 125? No. no. Uh, the, the open record is 136 now. Oh, 
guy, uh, Carl uh, Myerskov, 6'10", 365. He did uh, 136 kilo, yeah. like 300 pounds. They got it. Okay. <laughs> the record in the 125 kilo class, the 275 kilo pound class, is minus 122. Okay. And uh, you're minus 125. Yeah. Kilo, right? yeah. Okay, about 270. All right. Huh, 270. Sheesh. Yeah. How much do you now? Right now, I'm down to 255. 255. Yeah. <laughs> That's my weight class. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Not so bad. All right, biceps, let's see it. <laughs> <laughs> let's see it. <laughs> Come on, Alex. Squeeze it, Alex. <laughs> Uh, Valiant effort, my friend. <laughs> 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 Watch this. I'm not sure I would have done this on my first, first attempt. Like, I would have a hard time myself. Like, uh, 70 feels heavy enough. <laughs> it did, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the second, third time, like, each yeah. time it feels a little bit easier. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, Setting the bar high. Well, hopefully you don't push me too hard. I don't want to do too hard. I feel a little bit under the under the weather from yesterday's hammer girls. <laughs> well, if I don't push you, I'm not doing my job. Good. Okay. See that uh, your body weight doesn't matter too much on this. No. Well, you probably. You, you don't have as much water in your body, so you do better, your hands sometimes better. For sure. As my weight dropped 20 pounds, I have a better grip. Yeah. Not only strength, but yeah. stamina. Yeah. Big time with the stamina. Yeah. Your attitude about the thing, you fucking do. If it's stress related, you could do it. Uh, for you sure. Yeah. That's my, that's my, my feeling, too. That's the way I do it. <laughs> 100%. That's why I thrive. Oh, good. Sir. Still warming up. Yeah, it should be. Who knows? Who knows? It's day shit. Day Who knows? Yes, sir. Come on. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There it is. Well done. All right. No problem. <laughs> There you go. Good lift. Good lift. Alright. It's a big challenge. I'm getting to my limit now. I can tell. Oh yeah, I'm not sure how much more I got left in me. Should we go 110? We should. 100 percent. 110 percent. I think the part where you that you did uh, five years ago, I think. I think you I think you did 105 or 110. You know, now think about it, 105, that number sounds familiar. I think it was 105. Yes! Yeah! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Oh, man. Oh, wow. Put some weight on that bar. Right? Seriously. Right? That's why you open it. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, man. Come on. Come on. Yeah. You got that? Shit. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, man. That's tough. Thanks. I was just hoping you wouldn't get it. Yeah, I was, <laughs> just hoping. I was hoping I didn't want to lift it anymore. Oh, man. You're ruining his training week. <laughs> ruining my active rest week. Yeah, active rest. <laughs> well, this was your idea, by the way. <laughs> yeah. You and your brilliant ideas. Yeah. So. Yes! Oh, wow! Jeez. <laughs> it was supposed to get harder. Right, yeah. <laughs> wow. It got easy, I swear. So you've got to get it off the floor and then you accelerate it. 
faster you go, the less time you have in the tension. Okay. When I train this, I usually do, when I do reps, I, I track this uh, t time in the tension by doing like a two or three rep sets, a lot of them, yeah. the lighter weight, like this weight or lighter, and I do it, um, do it, but I set it down, but I, I don't really grip, I keep holding on to it. And then you have a lot of time in the tension. It's on the endurance. Shit. That'll explain that. We'll give it a shot then. See what happens. Yeah, you can see, it. see it. Oh. Good. Yeah. Go. Yeah. yeah. You got oh, that. Shit. Yeah. Not too bad. That was good, man. Yeah. Is that 110? Yeah. Uh, 115. No, 115. 115? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're on the record board, bro. I made it to the record board. Yeah. 120. Well, it took five years of rest, but five years later, here we are hitting PRs. <laughs> it's a proper showdown. Didn't <laughs> think we're going to be this close. Yes. 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 Yeah. 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 Hell yeah. Oh good. <laughs> Jeez. All right. Damn, Lou. That's a pep in that stuff. <laughs> Seriously, it's real. Jeez. I think you're hitting a world record today. <laughs> it's real. Uh, hey, man. It's looking really good. Sheesh. Oh, hey. Yeah! Yes! Fuck yeah. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. oh. Well, that's good. Oh, yeah. Hang it in there. You are. If I was shitting my teeth, my pinky was about to slip. Uh oh. We're knocking on that door now. Well, you have, you have good, very good hands with it. You have really long fingers. So it helps. You get a lot of surface on there. Oh, for sure. But the grip doesn't feel too uncomfortable. So. So you're going like two and a half kilo over the world record. One to five. One to five. I've done it before in you know in training. It doesn't count doing it in practice, so I've done it in practice before. In arm wrestling, there's an attachment that we use, which is identical to this. Yeah. We just put it to a pulley system yeah. and do this with it. Yeah. So the grip we have here on the Saxon bar is identical to the grip in arm yeah. wrestling. Yeah. It's yeah, just yeah. like this. Yeah. You get your fingers on it like that, it's very good. Mm. And yeah, having long fingers helps, of course, but I can say. There's some people who are you know, strong, that's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, they're just long and lanky. Yeah, yeah I, in, uh, when I was in high school, I started a gym in, uh, in Stronheim, Norway, called Crossfoot uh, 60, 1967, and that's KK67, and it's still uh, one of the most prominent. Uh, uh, powerlifting clubs in in Norway. Um, when I st when I st I was the first chairman, it was it wasn't a for profit thing. It was a non profit. We owned it. The members owned it basically, and we um, and we uh, had the bodybuilding, powerlifting, and Olympic weightlifting. So we had and we had a lot of we had great facilities for that time time. We had fantastic facilities. All uh, we had platforms with uh, Ileco bars and Ileco bumper plates. Uh, and courtesy of the Olympic weightlifting because we got that from the government <laughs> the, because they were an official sport and uh, it's still still existing and has a lot of champions and and they still arrange uh, equipment uh, arrange uh, competitions um, they're uh, they're only powerlifting now though no Olympic lifting no bodybuilding in there so you're one of the first powerlifters of all time well, I don't know about that, but I, I was pretty early. I lifted in, I, I think my first powerlifting meet was probably in 1967, probably. And, uh, and that was probably only two years after the first uh, American National Championship, which was in 1965, I think. So it's a pretty brand new. And I, don't know, I didn't know that at the time, but I, I, uh, during my late teens, I won, uh, I won uh, age group and junior championships in uh, Olympic lifting and in uh, and powerlifting. 
probably the thing was only juniors, I think. We didn't have any age group there, because it was a brand, brand new sport. So I was in the junior division, and I had nationals in junior. And in bodybuilding, I was junior champion. And right before I left for America, I won the national senior championship, Mr. Norway. Hmm. All right. Huh. What a resume, man. What a resume. You've seen it all. Long time ago. Yeah, you've seen it all. Now you're about to see a 125 kilogram Saxon bar world record attempt. <laughs> all right. Here we go. This is what you do, sir. Come on. Yes! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! yeah. yeah. Oh. Ooh. I wouldn't have gotten in the competition, but... Ah, uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, so close though. Well, like an inch away from Mark. Yeah. If you didn't do those heavy hammer curls yesterday and you were peak, I mean, you're getting this. This is yours. I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna do it uh, in uh, two weeks. Okay. Let's go, Larry, come on! Larry. <sighs> You do it, I'm, I'm coming right behind you. I'm doing it again. I'm trying to get it. I'm making you work today, boss. <laughs> Squeeze that shit, let's go. Come on. Get up! Come on! Uh, uh, I had my best attempt today, for sure. It's all good. I'll, I'll take 120. Yeah, 120 is amazing, bro. 120 is not too bad. Yeah. Uh, uh, but you got it up higher than me, so you still win. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you definitely okay. still win. Um, this is it! Yes! Yes! Oh, yeah! Oh, my yeah. God! Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm not so happy with it. They went up and down. <laughs> that is it. That's incredible. Yeah, sheesh. Unbelievable. It's, really, it's uh, really a form of fatigue. I am not able to push as hard as I feel like I should be. And I, I, I kind of I let up. It's funny. I mean, I, I don't want to let up, but I am. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Your body's fighting against you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I think you may be one of the few people that can lift uh, that yellow, that uh, white oh, dumbbell. Yeah. Wow, that thing is really good. One. Yeah. Very hard. How much is uh, that thing weigh? 180. Oh, jeez. But it's a very thick handle. Uh, last time I did it, I, Martins and I were here, we tried it. I, I was able to lift the Martins, could not. No way. Yeah, but I had, there was another good kid from uh, San Diego. It's about, you know, 280, 300 pounds. Okay. Big, tall guy with uh, good hands. That's uh, an amateur strong man. He did it, too. Huh. So there are been people, but I, I, even Brian Shaw tried it. He couldn't do it when he was there. Uh, but it's a lot about day form. I would say that. I don't do it every time I try mm -hmm. it, but I've done it several times. Well, mm -hmm. Thomas did double. Which is 170, right? Yeah, 172. How much? 172? 172 right there. Okay. That's an average man. <laughs> and the size of my balls. <laughs> Damn, bro. Woo! How do you think you got it? Oh, not happening uh, either. Today. Yeah. Maybe the Saxon. I think it's in Saxon, yeah. Because yeah, that's what you are. I usually tell people, oh, yeah, just put it between your legs. But then when I do it, I just grab it anyway. <laughs> right, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. <laughs> Too easy, man. Ha, <laughs> ha, Jeez. Too easy. <laughs> yeah, I wish that was going on, but no way. <laughs> so, you definitely are more conditioned. That's why I guess you're starting to drop off like mine has just now. Yeah, mm -hmm. you, you may be conditioned for the arm wrestling, but I'm conditioned, conditioned for this. I do a lot of it, so even even though, but I don't know if it's conditioned enough to do that. that, that right. But maybe you'll inspire me. Yeah, yeah. I'm here, man. I'll be here, man. I'll be sweating my feet. There is no special technique, just being strong yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah, it's, 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 uh, you know, people say, oh yeah, but your fingers are long. Yeah, but if you look at my fingers in, on, the, on, the, on the dumbbell, they doesn't come around at all. You see, show here. Yeah. I'll show you on, my, on the dumbbell. Just look on this side. Mm -hmm. So you... There's a regular hand goes around just as much as mine. Right. Mine, mine is thick, so it uh, yeah. doesn't come around. It's long, but it's, it's uh, always thick. 
Hmm. I wonder how uh, our hands compare to each other. Should be uh, pretty close. I think yours should be good. Wow. Well, you're definitely thicker. Yeah, I'm thicker. thicker. That's what it is. Years and years. <laughs> wow. I don't remember mine being so big when I was your age, actually. Interesting. Yeah. I don't I mean, remember it being. That's, yeah, that's just crazy. Just, uh, like hmm. gloves. I always, right. I, I always, my, my, father, my father was a shoemaker. So he would work with his hand all the time and always left work, worked uh, with his hand, right? So I used to, when I was growing up, I said, I want those hands, I want those hands and those forearms. <laughs> <laughs> took, me, took me another 20, 30 years before I got there. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah. It's a marathon, I see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Jeez. Like I have little girl hands next to yours. <laughs> Yeah. What do I have? A baby hand. Baby hand. <laughs> yeah. I think the uh, art are different. I, I may, be, may have more more hand and you have uh, more finger. Ah. Uh, or it, well, it is, it is not that different, is it? Hmm. I, when I look at your hands, I think they're different. But when I when I hold them up, they aren't that much different. Hmm. Well, you have more palm. Yeah, you have more. So here, yeah, yeah. yeah, look at all that right and there. And I'm very wide. Yeah. I should, I should have been a boxer, huh? Oh yeah, definitely. Look at the width of that fist next like, to mine. And the wrist, whoa, look at that thing. I didn't notice that wrist, man. That wrist is not normal. <laughs> a lot of it is a bit wrist strength, though, I think I own all of these things. Because you to, if you can control your wrist, you can control your hands, you know? Yeah. Sounds like arm wrestling. Right? Yeah, I think it'd be great arm wrestling. Yeah. Very, very good arm wrestling. <laughs> all right, boss. All right, yes, let's see it. Wow. It either goes or not, so. All right. Here it is! Yes! Ooh. Yep! Yes! Nope. Nope. Oh, yeah! Oh, wow! Damn! Jeez. What a man. <laughs> what a man. <laughs> Jeez. Unbelievable. Yeah, uh, better on the, better on the on left than on the right. Yeah. I've done both hands before. I did it uh, before, but uh, sometimes when you miss on the right, you try the left and it's easier. Mm. His nervous system is already geared up and, and your heart hand is uh, rested. It's the gloves. Oh, fantastic. Considering mm -hmm. I haven't gotten this one up yet. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel it. I just right. feel the fatigue. Yeah. This is like the Rolling Thunder, but the, the, this is called the Rolling Thing from the grip TV. And it's harder. It's thicker. I, I think, I think the very best lift to anybody has done is a little over 100 kilo. Wow. Yeah, I know, I am 100. We had the original, me and Martin had the original world record, it's like 96 or 97 kilos of mm. But it was still you know, all an official record. Not, not an record. Uh, Mark, you can raise, man. About 55 kilos, uh, 55 kilos. 110, 115 pounds. I said the Rolling Thunder by Iron Mine was originally uh, developed to be a training tool for uh, for uh, for uh, lifting the inch dumbbell. Oh, yeah. They the same size handles, but uh, and the same thing with the the grip tin is just a copy, but it's a actually an improvement of the real thing. But it rolls much better, so it's a over, over, over same bitch. It's really, <laughs> uh, really hard. Yes, it's definitely thicker than the Rolling Thunder. But I never knew what the no, Rolling no, Thunder was. No, no, it's the same thickness as the Rolling Thunder. I think it's identical. Oh. But the, the Rolling Thunder doesn't ro rotate as easy. Ah. Oh, okay. okay. The rolling thing is more of a rolling thing than the rolling thunder. <laughs> That's very basic to what it is. Rolling thing. I'll go with that for now then. <laughs> in, in, in training with this, I always lift with both hands. I lift one. I always use both hands. Right. Never, never just do one hand. Find that out. Find this one out. That's not a choice. I will. And you injured or something. Yeah. Because in, even in competition, you end up sometimes using your weak hand. You saw me on the on the white dumbbell. I was uh, it's done. the white dumbbell. Oh, oh, oh. Well, that's that's it just hit me pretty fast. It does actually. Yeah. Did you miss on the other one there? I did. Yeah. Sorry. Did you miss on one? Did you missed on the. I left? missed on the right actually. Yeah, the right toast. 
Yeah, the right is uh You better use a smaller weight than you're gonna use a five and five kilo place. <laughs> I don't Bob. Come on. Come on. There you go. Come on. Ah, oh, dead. Yeah. You can feel when it's dead. Yeah. Oh, oh Jesus. Yeah. That's so easy. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Okay. He's, he does this. Yeah, this is his thing. This is definitely his thing. Oh, my God. Three. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've been going up just to five, which is a courtesy for me. He can yeah. go up probably a 25. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think you go over 90, I think. Oh yeah, that's, that's really awesome. Well, we're going up then. Yeah. <laughs> we're going up. Sorry, we've got to push him in. <laughs> so this exact movement, we use in arm wrestling training, and I've tested with this exact same hand from Juji, same setup, the best arm wrestlers in the world, such as Hermes and Vitaly Lelettin, and like the very top yeah. 10, and they're doing around 90 to 100 with this handle. Yeah, Hermes having the he, he's done the most with this one about 105 I believe he's done. Ooh. Yeah, and he he's like number two arm wrestling world right now. Well, this is 90. So he'd be a great arm wrestler. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, sir. Come on. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh my God. Well done. Awesome. Doesn't that's yeah. enough for me on this. <laughs> yeah. You know what? I think we're gonna, we got to bring you on the table, man. We have a table in the car. Yeah. We got to get yeah. you on the table. I got to feel what that what that's like. I got to have a taste yeah, of it. My wife is weak, but uh, that would be the only thing. Well, the good thing yeah. is that the wrist is the, that's wrist the most is. important thing, man. The chain starts from the fingertips to the wrist. And mm -hmm. <laughs> look at the yeah. wrist. You have the wrist of a seasoned arm wrestler. Yeah. Arm wrestlers have wrists like that. I mean, I'm not there yet. I've been doing it for three years. <laughs> look at the difference right. here. Oh my god, yeah, that's hold it there. Yeah. World record power lifter. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Strong hands. Okay. Uh-huh. Two chances. But you've arm wrestled before, right? Yeah, I mean, not to be a competitive try to do it, so I have a little idea. Try to avoid getting hurt anyway. Spend okay. time. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he drinks it, that's what you're at. Yeah, I'll go over there. So, what you just need to do, Ode, yeah. is you need to connect yourself to the table. Yeah. Okay, and instead of just trying to push to the side, just try and pull him backwards yeah. oh, this yeah. way. Yeah. Go backwards all the time. Don't even worry about the side. Oh, okay. Okay. Sure. Okay. Against Resistance the table. Stick your right foot under. Yeah, right on, right foot forward. He pulls and then, him over the board. Yeah. And then you have he to a moss square up the shoulders. You know, so. okay. Once you start, then you can you can shift if you want to. Let's go easy on him. Okay, Boom. Take the arm over the top. Ready? Go. Just keep pulling backwards, backwards. Yeah. Backwards, backwards onto his fingertips. Yeah, that's good. Uh, elbow down. Oh, yeah, keep yeah. your elbow down. When the elbow comes up, arm breaks happen. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, it's it's a foul. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh my God, that's just. Wait, where's Evan's hand? Hmm. <laughs> right. I can't even see his hand. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Probably said my bike. Yeah, I feel difference here for sure. Yeah. Wow. Just be careful, because. Uh, he has a thing going, coming up. Yeah, <laughs> competition. Yeah. Wow, nice. <sighs> that's what that's. Yeah, yeah there's strong. a big difference. There's a big difference because I yeah. have no bicep. Yeah, I swear wow. I can. Like this. Night and day. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow, he's strong now. <clears throat> yeah, he's strong. <laughs> hey, he's a strong young man. Yeah. Try to get your hips a bit yeah. tighter to the table. Yeah, oh, hips yeah. tighter? Yeah, yeah. yeah. so you try to wrap your leg around the pole. Uh-huh. That's a good like, the other way. The other way, man. Yeah, weld oh, okay. into that yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> man. Okay. So, yeah, that's good. Yeah, but you still want to pull me that way. Okay. So it's all the force. Yeah. Instead of discriminating oh, there goes his wrist. Just a crap. Oh! Yeah, his wrist adjusted. He might have scared your head. Nice chiropractor. Yeah. Just hot. I'll drive you to the hot chiropractor. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't have a chance. 
I have, I have nerve damage on my left side. Oh, so. yeah? <laughs> you gotta stop cranking on it, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Left side is Yeah. Biceps. Oh, yeah. Damn, look at that. This is, yeah, there it is. Let's be gentle. Yeah, all right. All right. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, so you're just trying to push into the side. Mm -hmm. uh, and he's gonna, his force is gonna be going the opposite way. Right. It's a little slightly on the dangerous side. You want to pull him this way. Don't even worry about pushing him to the pack. Mm -hmm. Well, that's where now I'm in. saying it's an isometric hold. Yeah. You're not doing anything. So when I'm pulling anyone, my arm never does this. Uh -huh. I just move with my body and right. rock my arm. Mm -hmm. Okay? Right. So still, you're still moving mm -hmm. your arm. You just want to move your body and keep yeah. your arm yeah. isolated. So it's just, it's not really doing anything. It's just yeah. staying mm -hmm. locked and you're moving your body yeah. with your arm. I see, I see. Yeah. Just yeah. You can go down a bit more and move your elbow, other elbow I'm so higher. scared now. Yeah. Keep higher. pulling backwards. Pull back on his fingertips. Yeah. Go. Yeah. That's Pull backwards. There yeah. you go. Hammer curl him. Nice. Yeah. Good stuff. Okay. There you go. Nice. Straighten you go. your wrist out. Okay. Okay. Now, oh, do you want to just pull back that way? Pull back, hammer curl him. Okay. okay. Ready? Go. Slowly. Good. Oh, yeah. There you go. Are your hips under the table? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Relax. Elbows down in the pack. Keep elbows down. Uh, okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Man, he was strong. Yeah. <laughs> Real strong. Got great hands. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, no, that's right. You know, it's decent. So. I bet the mouse was in the right hand and left on the cock. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, you're right. You're right. You're right. I can't believe you do the floor. Like, you have a good grip. Good wrist. Yeah, good grip. Mm -hmm. That's a safer way to arm wrestle. This is not usually the way I arm wrestle. Mm -hmm. okay. But see, what you're doing is you're trying to hold me here. Yeah. This is terrible. Wrist. Yeah, yeah. You know, you want to pull me in. Yeah. yeah. Pull me over to your side. I realize that. Yeah. Okay. Pull okay. so me over. Go. Yeah, there you go. So does it oh, no, no, actually. Stay in plus, stay in plus, stay in plus. Stay in plus, stay in plus. Look at his face, look at that. Damn, blue bitch, come on! I can gas it up, yeah. Come on! <laughs> All right, guys, we're wrapping up today's training session with O, oh, the man himself, here at the training hall. And he had me beat on every movement we did today. And I think the longer we went on, the weaker it's going to get, and the stronger you're going to get. <laughs> but it was really cool to witness that. Um, honestly, blown away. Huge inspiration for the next generation to see, okay, wait, I can be 73 years old and still stronger than a world record powerlifter. How cool is that? You know? Um, so, major inspiration, man. 60 years in lifting. Thank you for having us in your house. And on that note, if we're so lucky, we might be able to get Julius Maddox, the best bench presser of all time, yeah. the human house, here to the training hall to test his grip strength. How cool would that be? If you yeah. want to see that, That'd we need your cool. hype yeah. and support <laughs> down below. You need to see the encouragement because it's this weekend, guys. That would be incredible. Anyways, thank you for watching. Follow Old and the gentleman here today, and we'll see you guys very soon in the next one. Take it easy.